Hey, 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 it's Mindy, and I have some things to show you today. I have something to complain about. I'll talk about that in a minute. But these are from Diamond Art Gift. So thank you, Diamond Art Gift, for reaching out to me and asking if I wanted to show some things. I truly appreciate it. Let's move this aside, and let's talk about it. Let me just start with the big one. Let's just go there. Okay, let me talk about this painting. So I love this painting. All right. I absolutely love this picture. It is one of my very first orders I ever made when I started diamond painting. I bought it on Amazon and I didn't know at the time it was a little partial and it was just, it was bad. Um, we did it at school with my kids and I gave it to one of the kids. And so I thought, I saw this, let me try this again. Now, as you can tell, this is a fairly large painting. It is a 50 by 50. I still don't think it's going to turn out all that well, but um, it did not help one bit. Look at the poor canvas. This poor thing has been beat up. It was literally folded in half. So it was rolled, you know, it was rolled like this, and then it was folded up like this in the bag. I mean, it was crazy. I don't even know if it was shipping, if it was the company. I have no idea, but it was a mess. I've been trying and trying. It's going to need to be ironed before you can work on it at all. But I just, I don't know how it's going to turn out. I really don't. Um, I love this image, though. I've loved it. I mean, since the day I first set eyes on it, I just love the old Santas, I love them. I, I call them like um, Father Christmas or whatever. They're gorgeous. Anyhow, um, you know, someday maybe I will iron it and give it a go. I don't know. I would hate to put this much time in it and have it not turn out. What do you think? What do you think? It doesn't look too bad in the camera. It really doesn't look bad when I look at it through the camera lens. You can see the birds. You can see the moose, his lantern, his staff. It doesn't look too bad. I don't know. It might turn out. Unfortunately, it comes in this type of packaging here, which none of us really enjoy this. There's nothing wrong with these drills. They're just harder to kit up. That's all. So there's that. Anyhow, I was so disappointed when this came to see what a shambles it was. But tons of confetti. I mean, there's it's all confetti, right? <laughs> Anyhow. Um... Let me know your thoughts on it. So boo to the shippers, whatever happened there, right? Okay, you can sit over there. Okay, what else do we have? I got another one of these. I ordered one of these. I got, what do I have on me? Like cobwebs or something. Um, it's one of these um, ceramic cutters. Where does it even open? Where do you open? Down here. <laughs> I used it already, my other one. I actually used it because my big, bold, and beautiful, I have um, sectioned off of washi tape and stuff. So it's just a little itty-bitty cutter on there. It cut right through. That's a little blade on there. It will cut you. Don't, don't think it won't. It will. Be careful with it. Anyhow, they work great for cutting like washi tapes when you got your painting um, sectioned off. So there's that. All right. I'm very interested to see this. <laughs> I'm not at all certain how this works, but I saw it on a couple different sites and I thought, okay, let's check this out. It comes with a toolkit, special drills, a whole bunch of special drills, and this roll. So what is on this roll? Let's show you what's on the roll, okay? It's taped up. Let's untape it. See what we got. Come on. Work with me. Work with me. Come on. <laughs> oh, here we go. All right. Here's what we have. It is a long strip, and it is quite long. It is just a long strip of, like, ornamental Christmas. I, like Christmas holly. No, a Christmas... What's the word I'm looking for? Um, it's very long. Wow. Um, garland. It's a garland. And it just goes and it goes. It repeats and whatnot. 
Oh, is this the middle? Like there's an arrow there. That must be like the middle. It, wow, it is long. It comes on a little foam roller. Isn't that cute? So that is long, long, long. I'm, wow. So you can put this like on a window. It would be kind of cool. Wow. It's too long for any of my windows, I think. I don't know. I got a great big window up there in the living room. I mean, you could stick it. It's a sticker. It is a sticker. Let's go to the other end. Hang on. Let's see. Pretty sure it's all sticky. Well, it's sticky now because there's the tape. Let's see. Pretty sure it's a sticker. Will it peel off? Will it peel off? I'm sitting here watching my chickens. They've been naughty. Yeah. St oh. Oh. Whoa. Oh, this part isn't. Okay. It actually. Wow. It would be just the. Actually just the design. So it's all like cut out around the design. That's interesting. You could cut it, but how would you cut it when you got drills on it? I don't know. Uh, it's pretty cool, though. I mean, uh, they had different styles as well. You know, there's always different styles of these things. So you could get a different pattern. I guess we'll call it a pattern. That's interesting. What will I do with that? i to figure that one out. No, no, you wouldn't want to stick it on a wall. I don't think it would come off your wall very good. I'd want to put it like on a window or something. I mean, our big window up in the kitchen, it would go up there for sure. But who can get up there? Not me. <laughs> all right. Here's, oh, the drills are so Christmassy. Christmas, Christmas all the way. Do, 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 do. All the way, all the way. So gold, yellow. Red, red, there's lots of red. Peachy color, greens, more green, more green, black, uh, bronzy color, gold. All right, these are pretty. Let me turn this over so you can see this. These are gold um, AB marquees and then teardrops. Red, those are the smooth ones. And then we have some little red marquees that are faceted. This is very unique. I got to think about this. What, what could I do with this? Where could I put it? I wouldn't want it to stick to anything and ruin it, you know, if it got stuck to it. Where would you put it? Wouldn't want to pull off, you know, like paint or anything. Let's look at this guy. All these toolkits. Toolkits everywhere. Toolkits. All right. He's super cute. Super cute. Christmas wishes and gingerbread kisses. I love them. Love them. So when I taught kindergarten, <laughs> gingerbread men were my thing at Christmas time. I had gingerbread everything. I had all the gingerbread stories, all kinds of different varieties. I had little gingerbread stuffed toys. We did a whole gingerbread village. Of course, we did the gingerbread men ran away, ran away and we had to find them. And it was, oh, my daughter made such fun of me. She's like, I'm so tired of gingerbread men. Guess what, guys? Guess what? It's come full circle. Their um, son that they are adopting, guess what he loves? Guess what he loves? <laughs> Gingerbread. <laughs> it's come full circle, I'm telling you. So I love it. So this is super, super cute. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. It's November right now. I wish I could just whip this up like boom, boom, boom and get it. It's pre-bagged. It's pre-bagged. That makes it easy, right? Pinks and oranges and browns and some white and green. It would make it easy to work on. Oh, my goodness. I really think I should do this. I mean, wouldn't that be fitting? Here. You made fun of me for my gingerbread men, my love of gingerbread men. So, boom. Back at you. <laughs> right? I've already made him a little um, lovey, little stuffy thing. It's a gingerbread man, a tie with a little blanket thing. Mm-hmm. Yep. There you go. <laughs> All right. And the last item is just this ho, ho, ho. This is for my husband. My husband wants to be all grinchy at Christmas time sometimes. I'm like, okay. Special drills, super quick, super easy. These are all going to be large. And then we got some teardrops and things like that in there. Look at the face on that guy. He's like, hmm, hmm, hmm. 
<laughs> right? <laughs> it's super cute, though. I think that's the second Grinch thing I've gotten. Maybe that one wasn't Grinch. I don't know. Anyhow. I gotta stop filming videos. I think I'm about done filming for a while. Maybe I can just sit and work. No, I can't. No, I can't. Tomorrow, I'm going to Dad's house for the yard sale. <laughs> Ooh, there's Christmas for you. Silver bells, red and green. Do do do. <laughs> That's what we get. All right. Oh, look at we have black, black. A B. Love it. I don't know where they go, but they're pretty. Look at them. Love them. Let's see. If we got small, clear, AB, marquee, teardrops, big teardrops. Oh, wow. Oh, look at those big. Oh, look at those. Love the purple. And we have gold and red. Oh, I've never had purple before. Those are beautiful. Green, purple, gold, and red. Do, 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 do. I love it. I love it. Love it. Love it. All right. So there we go, folks. There we go. Christmas has sprung. Christmas time is here again. I love them. What do you think? What do you think? Okay. I think I got to put some drills on this one. I've got to do that. Okay. All right. Thanks for watching, everybody. And thank you, Diamond Art Gift. If you're new here, I hope you come back. I mean, it's a fun place to be. And the people who return again and again, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> thank you for putting up with me. <laughs> All right. I will talk to everybody soon. Bye, you guys.